the anger of most people will be that you never decided to stay where they decided you at. See, people are very, people are very cynical. People have Rolodexes. They, when they foul you, they want you to stay where they foul you. When you met them, they said, she's a whore. That's where they found you. Every time your name came up, they said that's what the whore did. Every time the people hear you, did they see your kids? They say that's that whore's kids. Y'all want to hear me? The whore got a job. Because people will want to keep you where they found you. The anger of people is you getting out of their file. Y'all not there? This is why people get mad when you when it's why people get mad when you live for Christ because he changes your status. And he, it don't take no long time. Matter of fact, right in your right, listen, y'all, right in the funk. You ain't never been in sin yet, baby, till you understand this. I'm talking about the funk. You smelling yourself. Right in the funk, he changes you. Why people still see the dirty clothes you got on. You run around skipping and they get an attitude. Because who is, no, you's a crackhead. How'd she get out of foul? Now we got to find, who, who let her out the foul? Been down there talking to that preacher. See, they, they even get mad that you got free. Because people like to keep you where they found you. Oh, y'all better say something on that. Say amen. So this is why your family and people start tripping on you because oh, she was a pisshead. She's a drunk. See, she's a she. She the one can't get a man to bed. She the one man beat on her all the time. She ain't nobody. And they and they and they keep you in that file. And then when you change, then when Jesus changed your status, you better be careful. Cause don't think they change. They get indignant. Especially religious folks. The Bible said they were Pharisees. That's who he was eating it from. And to be honest, the disciples were standing right there. Even they couldn't change their mind. Say amen. So don't go off what religious folks say either. That's why it's a personal thing. When Jesus changes, he changes you on the inside. He changes your heart. When the seed of the word gets down in your heart, it germinates and brings forth a, 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 a seed of faith. That cannot be shaken by the opinions of men. And all of a sudden you'll be standing in a place they think you don't deserve to be in. There's been many times I walked in places and I was about ready to hang my head down. I sit there and talk to bank people and, 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 and people with money. And I meant, and it just, just because of where I know I came from. It was a little intimidating. I was a little intimidating. I was a little intimidated to walk in her. And I remember walking down and looked at my shoes and I heard the Lord say, lift your head up. Lift your head up. You don't know they the ones really lost. You stand. Then people say, who is this man with this confidence? I might not got two dollars, but I'm confident that I'm saved. I know that Jesus loves me. Do you know? I don't care you got no money. Do, do you know? 